everyone. Today I'm going to show you how I do my daytime look. I don't like to do a lot of makeup during the daytime, but this is a basic yet neutral and chic daytime makeup look. I've done it already on this eye, as you can see. It's very light, very, very light, but a lot of people do like going lighter during the day instead of very dramatic, and I'm going to show you how I do that. Um, by the way, first off, I'm wearing this really cute green top. It is from H&M. I've got some people who were asking me on the last video I did what top I was wearing and where it's from. So I got it from h and It's very cute, very, very trendy for St. Patty's Day coming up tomorrow. Also, you'll see the same top in the next video I do on a St. Patty's Day daytime eye makeup look. So let's get started. Um, first one I'm going to do is base with this Alme concealer. It is a really good brand. It also comes with this, I don't know if you can tell, but this brush, this brush tip. It's really good for putting on. So I'm going to start by just squeeze a little bit and you put it and it comes out really nicely. So just put it all over the base of the eye and the eyebrow right above it. And I usually just take my finger and blend it in. And as you can see, it blends in nicely. This is a, a really good primer. It's not that expensive. I bought this at a CVS and it blends in really nicely and it'll make your eyeshadow stay on longer. So I've already done the rest of my face with blush, bronzer. I typically don't wear powder or concealer on my face during the day or really any time. Um, I always just use bronzer first and then I go over my cheeks with blush. I do highlight my brows, which I've already done on this side and this side as you can see. But um, I use this brow fix. It's a brow kit from Milani, as you can see, and it comes with a highlighter and then two different brow filler colors. And then it comes with the utensils you can use, um, an eyebrow brush and a more finer brush for definition. So I use this to highlight my brow bone, and I usually just take my, um, I take like my, my ring finger to do this. Cause I just go up and go right under the eyebrow. Don't need too, too much. You don't want to look kind of like a clown or anything, but just a little bit and blend it with your finger. I like using the finger more than the brush because I feel like it gives it more of a natural look. I think a brush sometimes, if you don't blend correctly, it can make it look a little too heavy and too defined for this basic daytime look. So after I've used the primer and highlighted the eyebrow right underneath, then I'm going to, and by the way, this is very fast. I mean, it's a daytime look, so you're probably rushing to get to school or get to work. Um, next, I'm going to use this eyeshadow from Wet n Wild, very inexpensive, and it's called Fine Wink see that number 250 and it has kind of like a shimmer a shimmer to it I don't know if you can tell very nude neutral color just gonna take my eyebrow brush and it is a little loose it's not like a regular eyeshadow it's a little loose kind of like mineral makeup so I'm gonna dab it a little bit back into the container so it doesn't get all over my face and I'm just gonna Apply it to my eyelid. Now I'm not gonna. I'm gonna go right above the highlighted brow area. I'm not gonna go over it because you want to make sure that those two areas stay, stay, stay defined. So I go over my eyelid and work it in the crease. Make sure to work it in the crease. You can see it's coming up very, it's very light, but it has a little bit of a sheen to it, which makes makes for a very nice daytime look. There you go. Okay, so we're done with that. 
Next, you can either use a pencil or um, liquid eyeliner, but I'm going to use this liquid eyeliner from NYC. I really like this brand. Also very inexpensive. And then, you just draw on. I always tend to go on a little out. Just a little bit. Get it on that side. Alright. Still basic and a little dramatic, and of course. Just gonna finish it off with Great Lash Mascara and very black. I really like um, using a lot of mascara, so. Use whatever you feel comfortable with. I usually use at least three coats. And there you go. A really nice daytime look for the eyes. Very simple, very easy. Wear it to school, wear it to work. But it's just, it's very understated, but yet very defined, makes a nice statement, not too over the top. So I hope you've enjoyed watching and stay tuned for another video coming up very, very shortly.